Parts Hunter 5 here, 2012 Subaru Impreza, 5-speed manual, base model, no cruise control. Uh, did some research on the internet, thanks to Naziok, uh, found out that this car should be um, ready to put a cruise on. The harness should be in the column. Uh, I'm kind of banking on it because I did some looking online and I found this. Uh, part number will be in the description. There's several different part numbers depending on if you have an Impreza, Forester, Crosstrack, Legacy, whatever, Outback. Um, but depending on what you have, the harness may or may not made up. I do not know this stuff for sure. Um, I don't even know if this is gonna plug straight in. It's supposed to, I sure hope it does. So uh, basically my understanding is you pop the hood, disconnect the battery. There's two screws here behind the steering wheel. Um, basically you pop this off, disconnect all of your airbag and things, and then the wheel comes off. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with that stuff. 10 millimeter wrench, disconnecting the battery. I will say this is kind of a bear. These side holes are hard. The bottom hole, not so bad. You put the screwdriver in, you see the wire, you push it, it pops this open. Um, but these two are harder. I'll let you know how that turns out. That is the most ridiculous thing I've ever done. This little clip right there and that one right there are absolutely impossible to get out from down underneath of the screwdriver unless you can get in here and pry and see what you're doing. I don't even know how to explain to you to do that. But I'm going to disconnect all this electrical now. And then metric 17. Ah. Metric 17. This comes off. Okay, I've got that nut loose. I've been told not to take the steering wheel off without leaving the nut somewhat on so you don't pull the steering wheel off and smash yourself in the face. Mark with the magic marker, permanent marker, whatever, on, uh, on this stuff so you don't pull the wheel off and can't remember how you put it back together when you're done. Okay, I've got the steering wheel off here, and you can see that I had a heck of a time digging around on there trying to find the clip, because this little bit there latches underneath this. It pushes down and locks, same way with this one. Pushes down and locks. This one is super easy, you just push up on this from the bottom. That's why it popped off so easily. So now what I'll do is I'll take this screw out and uh, put my cruise switch in. Okay, I've got my switch installed. And everything kind of sort of back together. I unhooked my little stub harness that went to nowhere right here. And now I'm gonna plug this one this one's got a little brown tab and I'm thinking it goes in here just as a holder. Yeah, and then this one connects up here with my little tab dinghy uh, that goes on the airbag assembly. That'll be next.